Good morning. Here's a look at your Doppler radar. We're still going to be dealing with a little bit of leftover moisture on and off throughout the day today, which is good news. Some of us could pick up a little bit more rainfall. We've got this area of low pressure slowly making its way eastward, and as the moisture wraps around it counterclockwise, we're going to see some showers push in from the north. So again, not all said and done just yet. Some of us picked up a few hundredths of an inch. Others, like three points, had over three quarters of an inch, so definitely a wide range in our rainfall totals. And 5 a.m. this morning, we're still dealing with some very light rainfall just to the north of Benson and along the way to Douglas through Sierra Vista. So definitely seeing some rainfall on the board this morning. So again, some isolated showers will linger, especially from Tucson to the east, west of Tucson. Really not going to see much activity, but we will see a little bit more the closer to the New Mexico border that you live. Otherwise, mix of sun and clouds with highs in the low to mid 70s today to the south and east, though in the 60s. So another cool day below average, but that's all going to change very quickly. You know, it's going to kind of be like a slap in the face. We're going to hit potentially 100 degrees this upcoming weekend, so don't get too comfy with these very comfortable temperatures. They're not going to last too long, so enjoy them. Here's a look at your future cast now, right around 9 a.m. Again, you can kind of see that uh, counterclockwise motion around that low, a couple little isolated showers just to the north of the Tucson area with a few clouds continuing to filter in into eastern Pima County throughout the day. By 4 p.m., some isolated thunderstorms will be possible this afternoon, so keep looking out for their listening out for that thunder. A few lingering showers to the east, too, and then as we head towards 11 p.m., we're all pretty much going to dry out, and these clouds will shift eastward as well, so tons of sunshine for your Thursday. Could pick up a little bit more rainfall, but we're only talking maybe one hundredth to a few hundredths of an inch for places like Oracle, Wilcox, maybe up towards Stafford, too. Places like Bisbee may be uh, able to pick up a little bit more rainfall, and it's not to say that we can't see anything here in Tucson, but again, it's going to be very isolated. A lot of us are going to stay dry and not see anything. And then for the snow cast, could also pick up a little bit of snowfall for the higher elevations in Graham County, maybe for the Chiricahuas too. So a little extra snowfall possible today too. For your high is mainly in the low to mid 70s. Mix of sun and clouds, northwest wind at 5 to 15 miles per hour. Tonight dropping into the upper 40s and low 50s and to the south and east. A little bit cooler, a little more chilly, especially for Bisbee, only getting to about 62 and 66 for Wilcox, 69 for Nogales. This area of low pressure is going to kind of hang out kind of close to the southwest over the next couple of days. That is what has changed right now. Our forecast high on Saturday is 99. So the system that brought us the rain the, over the last couple of days is potentially going to keep us from hitting that 100 degree mark as we head towards the weekend. Looks like the hottest air will be off the coast of Baja, California. So right now we have it at 99. The record is 100 back in 2020, and that's not to say we couldn't push it and get there. But if anything, the area of low pressure bringing us the rain today is what could mess things up for us this weekend and keep us in that 99 degree range. Low 90s next Monday, Tuesday, so at least we kind of cool off, but still a few degrees above normal.